Hello everyone, today we are going to see how we can build a project roadmap uh, in PowerPoint in less than 10 minutes. It comes very often uh, that we have to build a roadmap for the project, for the program, uh, what we are going to do under various stages. So how we can quickly build it in less than 10 minutes, let's see. So we are going to start, let's go to a blank slide. Uh, we are going to use uh, features in PowerPoint itself. Go to insert and we have a various smart arts. I'm going to use, go into process. I'm going to use this one. Say OK. Now you see a text here. We have to change it. Click on arrow and enter it. Let's say I say stage one, then down arrow. We say stage two, then down arrow. We say stage three. Now what if you want to add further stages? You have to do enter add one more stage four you can see the diagram is updated automatically then say stage five that's it i want to use five stages uh, select them go to home choose a uh, font as century gothic uh, and i'm going to do control b and that's it now i'm going to come here you see our skeleton is ready now what we need to do is we need to add uh, I'm going to reduce the size further to 18 okay now what we need to do is how we use it I'm just going to little make it uh, large uh, and bring it between in between the slide okay much better now we need to add a messaging here so what we're going to do is we're going to insert a text box and we add your message here now I'm going to choose this font as Sancho Gothic and uh, 16 as a font size and then put it here now to make it more professional we can do small changes here what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose a shape as a line I'm going to increase the width to 1.25 color as gray and then what you can do is you can choose the end narrow type as this now I'm going to squeeze it a little and just put it here so that way it looks much better now you just copy say control D put it here uh, do a control D put it here do another control D put it here and then control D here we are good now let's say you want to add a highlight here and some of the message at the bottom so you have to make uh, adjustment for that uh, I'm gonna insert a line here uh, like this and uh, I'm gonna increase the width to 1.25 I'm gonna change the color to gray and I am going to use the dash type here now I can do control D put it one here control D control D and I'm gonna stretch it so that all are on the same level at the bottom here 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 now you can add your message at the bottom here you can control D put it here control D put it here control D and control D now uh, what we can do it to make it more professional uh, relevant to your project we can add certain icon here uh, I have put some icon in the slide I'm gonna copy them and use them here so what you can do is you can use there are certain icons available in the PowerPoint itself freely available you can use them and I'm gonna put them here uh, squeeze the size a little bit here then put it here here and here now what we're gonna do is we're gonna change the color right if you want to change the color just click on this one do a double click you will see there's change color option we can choose the color which you want I'm gonna choose this color so now at the end what you need to do is you need to just add a text box here so this slide is my project yearly roadmap and then I'm gonna use the century gothic and increase the size do a control B to bold control U for underline I can change the color so now let's do a full screen 
now you can see in less than 10 minutes your slide is ready you can add the message at the top you can add more details at the bottom you can change the icon uh, based on your messaging we can change the color the other way of doing is we can move the icons up also there it looks little different so here it is so this is how you can build a powerful uh, beautiful uh, roadmap in less than 10 minutes uh, that's it uh, if you like the video please subscribe the channel thank you very much